Hi, this is Peter E.B., Section Head of Breast Imaging at Virginia Mason Medical Center in Seattle, Washington. Thank you for taking the time to hear about the research that I've done with my co-authors, Linda Martis, Jeremy Palooch, Janice Chang, and Arian Chan, about technical recall rates for screening mammography after instituting an AI software program. Thousands and even millions of mammograms are acquired in this country every year. According to the FDA, we are required and strive to provide the highest quality mammograms every day to give us the best chance of detecting cancer early. However, despite our best efforts, some images are not up to snuff, and we ask patients to return periodically so that we can retake them. We want to decrease this as much as possible to reduce the added radiation dose, the time away from work for patients, as well as the resources and costs to us. In 2019, we added a software program to all of our machines that automatically assesses the quality of every single image that's done. We used that to provide feedback to our technologists who could access their results and then improve their quality independently over time. We looked back over a course of three years to see how this software program and feedback impacted both the performance of the technologists as well as the technical repeats that we so wanted to reduce. We had over 200,000 images, and this was the largest study of its kind in North America. What we found over those three years was that the scores for all of the technologists consistently improved over time. In addition, what we had hoped was also what we saw, which was that technical recalls for patients decreased consistently over time as well. Again, saving money, decreasing radiation exposure, and providing better overall care for our patients. What we conclude from this is that this kind of software program that's automated and provides a large amount of feedback to technologists is essential and highly valuable to improving both the patient care and patient experience. Thank you.